Hi guys and welcome to a very special episode. This is episode 7 of the Langley Lions Football Adventure and this is a definitely it's going to be amazing this one because we're playing Burton Albion at home in the FA Cup second round. I can't believe we've got to this stage, it's been amazing. Uh, we've kind of suffered a little bit in the league but uh, don't worry, I'm still happy, I'm still happy. Uh, we've got to the second round of the FA Cup, a lot of money coming in. Uh, from this one we're probably going to get, after a TV deal, probably going to get around 75 80 k which is massive for our club. Um, we've absolutely uh, smashed our transfer budget so we've, uh, we've, we've smashed around about 400 k something like that on players. Uh, but anyway, just going to quickly show you here uh, how our season's gone so far. So this is the schedule, we started off really well. Uh, for anyone who hasn't hasn't watched it, we started off really well, and then we kind of have took a little bit of a little bit of a lull really coming into um, not doing too bad, but we but we we're doing well in the cup game. We've just won our uh, cup against Braintree, uh, so in the cup we be we have in the FA Cup, sorry the proper FA Cup we've beat um, uh, we beat uh, lower stuff and then we beat Buxton, then we beat uh, Wrexham and then we, we we was like giant killers but against Scunthorpe and if we beat Burton now we are giant killers without a doubt but yeah we've took a little bit of lull in the league just to quickly show you the league table league table at the minute Vanarama North we've played 19, won 8, drawn 6, lost 5 um, but we're not doing too bad to be fair um, we, we, I'm very happy with that. Remember guys the media predicted that we would become we would come bottom of the league um, so we're doing okay after 19 games. Uh, a couple of plus points as well is that Tommy Lilly, our main striker, is actually a joint third in the goal scorers, goal scoring rankings at the minute with nine. Uh, so we're doing quite well there. Um, not that we 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 we're fouling a lot at the minute, so we are making a lot of fouls, uh, and we we can see we've probably conceded one of the less as well. So we're third in the chart, we're third in the table for conceding goals, and that all comes down to our main goalkeeper. Remember, a regen goalkeeper as well. Andrei Shepev. Uh, Andrei Shepev, he's been injured for the last three or four games, but now he's back for the main game, so that's good. Uh, I'm going to quickly take you through the tactics, what I'm going into this game with. It's a, it's a custom tactic. Um, I'm going in with this kind of style, um, so I'm going with a 4 2 1 3, uh, defensive midfield wide. Um, and as you can see, just going into the possession, I'm going to be playing out of defence, a bit of overlapping, quite wide. Running at defence, I'm gonna I'm gonna start it pretty. The mentality is positive. Now you probably think to yourself, well, not really the best tactic to go in against Burton Albion, but um, I'm gonna go in. I'm, I'm I'm going in. I'm going in strong. If we get beat, we get beat. It's it's how it is. We've 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 had a good run, um, and we will see. So anyway, just want to quickly tell you something as well that I, I, I was pretty excited about. We have changed our kits. Um, now <laughs> you don't normally do a mid-season kit change, but. For what's going on at the minute in the world, uh, I think it was a, a, an appropriate time to change the kit. And if you look at our kits here, check them bad boys out. They are cool. Uh, and again, guys, thank you very much for the feedback as well on Twitter, on Facebook, on Discord, uh, on YouTube. Um, you can follow me, like I said, you can follow me at FMWorks or FMWRX, uh, how it's spelled. Um, so that, that's where it kind of stands for, though, works. And you can follow the Langley Lions as well on Twitter, at Langley Lions FC. Anyway, let's stop chatting and let's get to the game. But yeah, I just thought I'd change the kits to support the NHS uh, for, for a great job that they're doing at the minute. Um, I know we pay for the NHS in tax and stuff like that, but it doesn't matter. At the end of the day... Uh, I'd, I'd pay a lot more um, and certainly pay individuals a lot more as well uh, so anyway they, they, they're just well worth it simple as that anyway let's get to this game Burton Albion away at home in the FA Cup second round done my tactics as you can see they're, they're one to two favourites but you know what I'm quite happy with that five and a half to, well four and a half to one four and a half to one theoretically um, I'm happy with that I'm very maybe because we're at home and our form's been pretty good at the minute look at our recent form pretty strong so uh, anyway guys this is it we're going into the game submit my team I've already done that I know that Gallagher Allison is uh, he's, he's lacking match fitness I know that but he is he has got a very strong uh, familiarity with that position so let's see how we go guys here we go guys, FA Cup second round, half 12 kickoff at Windermere Road in Manchester. Let's get to the dressing room. We've seen the team. Gonna go in passionate. Why not? Gonna go in passionate. Um and just yeah, let's let's see how we go. We've been on a good run lately, so let's go out there and impress me. Not a good reaction really, but hey ho, hey ho.
Here we go, guys. Here we go. A little bit of a pre-match. Uh, are you prepared for to face Burton? Are you happy with Owen McKenna's performance at fullback? Well, yeah, of course, yeah. Why not? Um, staying calm at this moment. Um, given Ambe Shepherd for lack of match fitness, how long can he last out there? He's good to go. I know he's got a bit of, yeah, I understand that he's only just come back, but let's just give it a go. Um, no comment. Let's just, let's just get to the game, guys. Your team selection today suggests uh, a change of tactics and might be on the cards. What are you? What is your thinking behind this? Um, we'll just we'll just have to wait and see. Here we go, guys. Guys, we're playing in blue today, and the reason is for that is that uh, when I did the pre-game editing before the Langer Lions, um, we I, I didn't change the color of the kits, which I was really good about because I wanted them to really resemble uh, the navy and yellow. Anyway, guys, two minutes in here. Um, Burton on the attack. Gets put out to Tommy Lilly. Tommy Lilly puts one over the top to McDonald. Can McDonald? He has. He's come on. McDonald straight away. Unbelievable. Three minutes in, guys, against Burton Albion. I don't believe it. Get in. Remember, guys, we are a regen team except for two players. Uh, well, saying that now, I have bought a couple of more uh, players, which I will go through at the end of this game, whatever happens. But look at that straight away. It's only five minutes in. 7.4 rating. That's great. Throw in there at the back. Parter. Parter whips one over the top to Tommy Lilly. Tommy Lilly. Bit of a weird ball to McDonald. Bit jumpy for some reason, but Kasumu to Sam McCarthy. Sam McCarthy back over to Gallagher Allison. Gallagher Allison. Oh, wow. Unbelievable, guys. We are on fire here at the minute. Two shots. 34 minutes. Uh, well, well, seeing that though, 30 percent possession. So they have got a lot of the ball at the minute. Let's just, uh, oh, no, yeah, that's, I thought I was on the break then again. Put a little concentrate in, but we're doing really well. Only put a concentrate in there because of the possession. Upped it on the break here. Great save by Shepev. Great save by Shepev when? Was that an own goal? No, it's Broadhead with the finish. That was a uh, clumsy defending that. Only eight minutes in, guys. One all already. Crazy game. Let's make them changes. I've got confidence in me, assistant manager. If he's giving me some advice, uh, I'll take it. 14 minutes in, guys. Team's doing okay. Condition-wise, we're doing good. Uh, Rating-wise, we're doing okay. We're roughly the same, really. We're doing all right. Conrad to Burton. Burton with one in. Comes back out to Broadhurst. Broadhurst to Quinn. Gets knocked out. Burton still here, still with the ball there. Great pass out wide to Atkins of Burton. Atkins whips it in. Great header away by McKenna. Murphy whips one back in for Burton. Oh, it's a goal. Burton. 2 1. What a game here, guys. What a game. 20 minutes in. Just going to pause it a minute. Changing the camera angle there a little bit. Just can't see things. Uh, it's a bit too fast. I might have to slow it down actually. Slow it down during the game. Twenty-seven minutes in, guys. I'm just going to demand a little bit more. Uh, Possession-wise, thirty-three percent possession at the minute. We started really well, guys. Really well. Thirty minutes in, still two one to Burton away. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, but we we're doing well. We're doing really well. We should have a full attendance today as well. Should have three thousand there. Without a doubt, you would do for a second round FA Cup. Can you imagine this game in real life? It'd be crazy, wouldn't it? Thirty six minutes in. I'm just gonna do a little pause. I'm just gonna see the tactics. Uh, see what see where we're at. Would help if I pressed it. Um, we're doing okay. Can't see too much problems there. Um, yeah, I'm just going to keep the mentality positive for now. You know, we're only 2-1 down, 37 minutes in. Well, 2-1 down up to now anyway. Burton, League 1 side, Burton. Uh, you know, they're a very good team. They're doing well in the league at the minute as well. 
scored a little bit tighter against uh, Jamie Murphy with their, their, uh, their assist. Looks like um, Quinn whips one in here for Burton. Oh, it's off the crossbar. I kind of uh, whips one in again to the back post. Powell. We didn't need that before half time, and that is bang on before half time as well. Oh, guys, this is a uh, disappointing in a way. I know we're going in with a positive tactic. Let's see if we can sort something out at half time. Okay, looks like we're getting to half time. Okay, okay, we started off really well, really well there. You know, we're playing a uh, a team that's free to the bubbles. Not bad tactics there. You know what? Let's give them some. Uh, Let's give them some passionate. Um, I'm not. I'm not happy with performance, but we're doing well. Look, you know, wasn't good. Mm. Let, let's do this one. I know we are the underdogs here, but uh, go out there and give the fans a performance to cheer for. I am probably going to change the tactics as well in the first five minutes. Just see how we go. Here we go. Forty-five minutes. Second half. Attendance three thousand. Of course, it was going to be three thousand. Our average attendance at the minute is something like 2,200, which is really, really good, actually. Um, great average attendance. I'm going to go to 55 minutes. Gallagher Allison has just been bought. Okay, let's make a couple of tactics. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, first of all, put us into a more balanced uh, mentality. Put us into more of a balanced mentality. Uh, Mentality and what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot on sight and hit crosses early to Tommy Lilly uh, I'm not going to play out of defense as well. Uh, I want to try and get the ball up and I'm, I'm also going to be more expressive But it's going to be more of a balanced obviously uh, And we're just going to shorten it slightly even though we've got two wingers. Uh, I'm going to shorten that width slightly in transition uh, We're going to start to regroup uh, Counter pressing is good, but we're just going to regroup when we lose possession Still count or when possession has been won, you know, of course we want to try and get up there uh, and we're going to distribute to the to the wide uh, to the to the to the wide flankers now, um, and that's it really. They, you know, still still take shorter kicks towards them. So I'm happy with that. Let's confirm them changes. Oops, we're on the pitch here. Joe Powell is pulling the strings out there. Uh, we need to close them down. Okay, Parter here on the ball. Can we get some kind of a uh, some kind of Edwin here? O'Hara here for Burton. We need to press him down. O'Hara whips one up. We should deal with this. Sam McCarthy to Parter. That was like the worst trip I've ever seen in my life. Like I didn't even. What, what was the penalty there for? Did you call him something instead of something? What? What was the penalty there for, guys? Can't believe it. Can't believe it. We started off really well, really well. I'm just gonna go to a split screen. Absolutely got it there. Absolutely got it. Gonna put a couple of shouts out there. Fraser for Burton. Burton Fraser whips one over to Atkins. Great tackle there by Parter, but he still gets to Atkins. Atkins whips one in. Gets to Murphy. Murphy with the header just over the bar. I'm going to put a little encourage out there in a minute. Only 65 minutes in. We, you know, it's going to be a great comeback now if we ever came back. But, of course, we're still massive on the dogs. Still.
68 minutes in guys it's not looking good is it it's not looking good at all but you just got got to kind of appreciate the run who we're up against uh and hopefully you know if we do if we do lose this game which it looks like of course um we will have to concentrate on the league um, and try and get that automatic promotion, um, which is only the top one to be honest. You go into a playoff after that, but um, it is what it is. It is what it is, as the saying goes. Um, let's just make a couple of substitutions, try and freshen things up a little bit. Um, Gallagher Allison uh, for Purdue. Purdue just bring Purdue back a little bit. Bring Purdue back. Bring McDonald back. We haven't really got a thing here, but I'm just going to go for. We've got a nut. No, I haven't really done nothing, actually. Uh, I'm going to do that change, actually. Um, we're going to go for. Um, keep keep him on. we do probably Sammy McCarthy, to be honest. Sammy McCarthy off for Will Taylor. Put Taylor in the middle to push it up a little bit. I'm absolutely gutted here guys, absolutely gutted, the team has done so well, uh, great run, we went through three qualifying rounds and we've obviously beat Scunthorpe in the first proper round, uh, but of course we can't put it again, you know, when, when Josh McDonald scored that first goal then I was absolutely buzzing, uh, but never mind, O'Hara, I'm just going to go to a split. To full. A bit jumpy, guys, and what it is is because I've, um, I've I've got loads of things running in the background like an idiot, <laughs> mostly Photoshop and and, and Adobe Illustrator. It's not good, but anyway, I'm not. Uh, I'm certainly not going to uh, come away from it now. Great header away there, McKenna to Shipev, Shipev, sorry. We are dilly dallying a bit, aren't we? We do need a bit of urgency here. Great ball over the top there to Tommy Lilly. Tommy Lilly is, isn't he? Could he? Could he? Oh, great save there by Burton. Okay, that was all right, Tommy Lilly. Probably do need a bit of support from there, but uh, I don't want to make it an absolute embarrassing scoreline. Short corner coming in. Nope. Purdue to whip one in on the 82nd minute. Purdue whips one in. Comes up to Tommy Lilly. O'Hara. Picks it out of the air like there's no tomorrow. Absolutely gutted here, guys, and it was uh, probably too much to ask, wasn't it, to be honest? <coughs> oh, oh, sneezed. <laughs> you get that in all shop centres now, don't you? Someone sneezed. Oh, God. It's worse than Trump in these days. But, you know, it's true. Murphy whips one in here to Atkins. Atkins, not another header. God, I thought it was another header going in goal then. Looked like it was a, a small save from Shepev off the off the crossbar. Put a little encouraged shout out there. I know it's the 87th minute. It's probably a, it's way, way, way gone now this game. But um, it's been a very good run. Look at that though, guys. I, I, but I'll show you I'll show you the stats at the end. It's the guy with the throw in. If we can score one here, it's a more reasonable scoreline. It's a bit of a an undinger game, isn't it? If we score a foot. Yeah, Tommy Lilly going through here. Tommy Lilly. Which one in? Oh, what a save by O'Hara for Burton. Wowzers. That's it, guys. I'm afraid it's. Uh, well, I, should, I should really make a third substitution, but it's uh, pointless now. <sighs> Looks like the cup dream is over, guys, until next season. It is. The cup, gate, the cup uh, run is over. Um, and the predicted score from everyone that Burton was going to win. As actually happened so guys it's uh I'm gutted I'm absolutely gutted um in our new kit as well apparently uh, but yeah we're in our new kit look at the stats so 12 shots to Burton's 13 
We had more shots on target as well, which is good. Possession, we just it was just a, the ball, keeping the ball possession. Uh, we did, we just didn't keep it. You know, after the first five, six minutes, we had it for the first well nine minutes, as you can see, uh, we was doing okay. Um, but yeah, five corners each, twenty fouls. We need to calm them fouls down. Um, tackles one eighty three percent, not good, not not too bad at all. Headers one sixty three over halfway. I'm happy with that. Um, yellow cars two against one. Um, yeah, it was just it was just one of them guys. Uh, we're playing a, a League One side. Uh, okay, it was at home, um, but uh, yeah, bit good about that. Bit good about that. So let's just get to the dressing room, give the guys some um, calm. Unlucky boys. It would have been nice to win, but it wasn't to be. What I've been saying all all uh, vlog to be fair. And they all agree with it, basically. They all agree that it was a bit too much to ask. Um, I'm just going to quickly show you the team for anyone who hasn't seen the Langer Lions team. I'm just going to quickly go through these. Obviously, it says that we've, we've been defeated in the second round of the FA Cup. Absolutely gutted. Um, I'll attend this press conference in a minute, but I'll just show you the squad. Um, so, I was talking about Shepev, actually. Um, and, yeah, Shepev, a regen goalkeeper. Pretty good. Uh, but, yeah, the rest are regens, except for, uh, like I said, Sam McCarthy, who was a, a player made by myself. Didn't give him the best stats in the world, uh, but he's, he's, a, he's a good defensive midfielder, uh, probably a National League standard. And then Tommy Lilly, uh, it's actually both my granddad named these, Sam McCarthy and Tommy Lilly. Uh, then you've got Tommy Lilly, um, who's a striker, and I would say them stats are around like a, a League 2 level. Um, probably, yeah, probably League 2 level, a good striker in League 2. Um, so yeah, it's a... He's scored a lot for us this season, and you know we've done okay. Just to quickly show you the transfers very quickly, the transfer history, what we've done within the the history. We've just got Abdullah Baggy uh, on loan from Weymouth, um, uh, who, who who's got good potential, uh, and he's, we've got him on loan to the end of the season. He couldn't play in that game. Probably wouldn't have won it for us anyway, so it didn't really matter. Uh, but apart from that, we've got Josh McDonald from FC Halifax for two and a half grand. Um, our biggest signing with date was David Kasumu, who played in that game then. Um, pretty good stats, pretty good stats. For, uh, we got him from MK Don for 300k, um, and he's valued at 100k now. So, yeah, it's um, it, it's it's good, and the rest was free transfers. and love. So, yeah, we, we've unfortunately, we've maxed out the transfer budget, but... Listen, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'm sorry we've, I couldn't bring around the Lions' results. I thought I went in with the right mentality. I obviously didn't. Um, you know, against Burton, what I wanted to do is try and win them from the front. Um, and after the first 10 minutes, I thought it was going to be an absolute uh, an absolute giant killing again. But uh, unfortunately not. We, uh, we we just didn't do it. We just didn't do it. Simple as that. Um, now what I've got to do is concentrate on the league. We are still in the FA Trophy as well. Um, so try and win that maybe. That will be That'll be good. Uh, but yeah, we're out of the FA Cup. But second round uh, for a National League North side. Um, quite happy with that. Quite happy with that. Guys, thank you, very much for, thank you very much for watching. Please remember to subscribe if you want to. Uh, you don't have to. You can just watch me if you want. Um, and you can follow me on Twitter at FMWorks or at FMWRX. And you can follow Langley Lions at Langley Lions FC. Also, I've just set up a Discord group as well, uh, which the link will be down there. So it's a Discord group that you can request kits from me if you want some kits making. But anyway, let's just see these kits for one last time before we go. Check them beauties. Let's bring it up a little bit. Oof, beautiful, beautiful kits. So yeah, guys, thanks very much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you on the next one.